One of the evidences of a chemical reaction is the formation of precipitate in a solution. And so I'm going to quickly demonstrate that with sodium hydroxide and copper sulfate. So we have uh, a solution of copper sulfate, which is uh, the blue, and we have a solution of uh, sodium hydroxide. And so if we put the uh, copper sulfate into the beaker, when we, when we add the sodium hydroxide, uh, the reaction is going to precipitate out a small solid. And so you can see now we have a um, suspension. And if we let it sit, if we, if we waited long enough and let it sit, the, uh, eventually it would form layers as, as you would expect in, in a suspension. But we're going to use the centrifuge and, and speed that process up. So I'm going to put about a half of a test tube here. And we'll speed this up with the... So what we're expecting to see happen is the um, centrifuge will separate the particles by density and we're going to end up with uh, the particles at the bottom and the liquid away at the top. And so we have a nice uh, separated suspension. So now we have the, the clear liquid on top and the precipitate has settled to the bottom of the test tube. So this is evidence of a, of a chemical reaction uh, which, which indicate, is indicated by a formation of a precipitate. Um, the details about the reaction will be in the comments as well as some uh, over screen uh, text. So that's, that's kind of how it is. Uh, so there we have it.